I do not think that I should apologize. Truth is never illustrated through the use of violence. This is one of the guiding principles that sits at the core of the illuminated thinking created by the man known to the world as Mahatma, the great soul, moral and spiritual teacher, founding father of India. Born October the 2nd, 1869, son of the minister of Port Bandar and Putlipai, he graduated in law and briefly practiced as a lawyer. During a trip to South Africa, Gandhi was thrown out of a train for sitting in first class, a privilege not afforded to black men and women. Hotels refused to host him, and whilst walking on the pavement amongst white South Africans, he was brutally shoved into the street. This episode brought about the birth of a political leader. From that moment, Gandhi fought against the violation of human rights, and even when provoked, he would refuse to denounce his aggressors, ever more convinced that non-violence is the only way to combat violence itself. On the basis of his traumatic experiences in South Africa, Gandhi developed the concept of Satyagraha, that literally means adhering unflinchingly to the truth. As Gandhi saw it, physical force is only used by weak people. Real strength resides in a person's capacity to express their ideals. On the 11th of September 1906, Gandhi publicly proclaimed his philosophy for the first time. Public support was virtually universal. One must never oppose arrest. One must never oppose the law. One must never respond to violence with violence. But one must strive to affirm vigorously the will of the people and uphold religious freedom. Gandhi often used hunger strikes as political weapons and would eventually renounce sexual relationships and pass one day per week in absolute silence. In 1947, it was with regret that Gandhi was present at the proclamation of independence of his country. The liberal nation that he envisaged was not born on that day, but instead two states, made up of the Indian Union and Pakistan. This separation would ultimately provoke a civil war between Hindus and Muslims that would result in the death of nearly one million people. On the 30th of January, 1948, Gandhi died a violent death from two gunshot wounds. This was to be the destiny of the man who had dedicated his existence to nonviolence.